Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Tinker77, and we're again on the QTech world, and there have been some changes since the last time we did a video. That's because we did a stream. And if you recall last time, last video, we worked on making these machines, and we have one last step. We're trying to get to the step that we made, which was the uh, lithium dust. We had gotten to basically here where it was making from brine. It was making lithium, liquid lithium. We had to use a rotary condenser to take it from lithium liquid to a lithium gas. And you put it in this device here, and it made lithium dust, which is going into our storage system. So that's working great. So that was one thing we wanted to do. Then I was looking around at some of the other requirements for solar cells. We had to make DT fuel. So I made this huge contraption of stuff to do stuff to make DT fuel. This is for really for the last solar panel thing that we need. And then we had more time. So we decided to work on a whole process. And it eventually comes out and makes um, this osmium, which is a slurry. It takes this clean slurry that's produced right here and puts it, hooks it up with some of uh, acid here or something like that and makes, yeah, sulfuric acid and clean. This makes osmium. What are we doing here? It makes this whatever this is and we crystallize it, which makes osmium crystals. That's it. it. So we did a lot last time on a stream. If you missed the stream, you really should uh, take a look at that. I try to stream a few times a week. My normal schedule is for sure Thursdays and Sundays at 7 p.m. Eastern. And then sometimes I do other streams uh, whenever I feel like it. So <clears throat> one of the next things I found that we're going to need, I'm trying to get these out of the way, is we're going to need a lot of ender pearls. And I've come up with two different ideas for getting ender pearls. Today we're going to try one of them. And hopefully this will work out. The way we were trying before was with a mob farm. And that seemed kind of difficult. So we're not going to do that today. But we are going to, let me get some more dirt. We're going to get some brew stands. Okay, I'm going to uh, try and see if we can get these villagers. I guess I should bring the villagers over here. Maybe I should build a space for the villagers here that I can trade with. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do villager trading. And we have to get them to be cool. So let's let's go over there first. Let's go see the villagers. We've got a little bit of time. We can always come back and get more materials. I'd rather just make these guys make sure they are clerics because I believe the clerics are the ones that will give you Ender pearls, maybe. Once we have the trades, the thing is, I'm worried about is that we're gonna have to go back and forth to get lots of trades. So, because this is kind of a far distance, we might be better served to move the guys. We can do that in a little bit, or I can do that like off camera after this video. But way over here, golly, it's way over here, is a village, and I know we've been here before, and I know we have um, worked with this. So I know we trapped some guys in here. So let's see if they're still there. And I think we'll make them into clerics. Okay. Uh, where are they? We blocked the door. I think we blocked probably with some cobblestone or or wood. There's some guys right there. So we didn't want them getting out. You can hear them there. I'm going to make like a little room here that we can set up so we don't open the door. I don't want to even risk that. And let's see, let's, um, now for now, I'm going to put myself in here so that I can't get out there. Okay. That should be good. You can see there's two guys in here. I'm going to take away one of these and put a brew stand in there and I'm going to put one over here. And yes, they became a cleric and I'm going to open this up so I can see, so they shouldn't be able to get out and that's what we want. Okay. So let's go see if we can trade with this guy. What does he want? He wants emeralds for redstone. He wants a lot of rotten flesh, which we don't have. So that's, I think we only have like one emerald. So we got to see if we have any rotten flesh. We should have some, but I don't know. So we got to start to work on this process. This could be uh, interesting. <laughs> okay. But they can't get out here, right? And they, nobody can get into them. So we should be safe. I'm going to do that and seal it up. Let's go home. Rotten flesh and emeralds. If we don't have a lot of that, hopefully we can figure something out with this. Let's see if we can trade. The goal here today, guys, is to see if we can get some em uh, er ender pearls. So let's look up emeralds. Yes, we only have one. That's bad. And rotten flesh. <clears throat> we have enough for one set. Well, that's not good. 
You may not be, may not be able to trade. Um, let's take, I know that they sometimes trade for some of the ores. Let's trade some, keep some ores with us just in case. You can see we're still killing the cows. That's good. Okay. We might have some emeralds over at... Let's see. I have a uh, machine over here that I set up during the stream that's just gathering the ores. You can see we ran a pipeline over there. Let's just go check it out. Check its storage really quick. There may be some emeralds in there. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? This chest is a little bit big, though, so we got to... It's kind of off camera. I don't see any emeralds at all. I doubt there's any up here. I see diamonds. So no emeralds. We may have to set that up in like a um, an extreme hills biome. Anyway, let's go and get uh, see if we can go talk to these villagers. Hopefully, the other one turned into a uh, cleric as well. Yeah, I think it's going to be a better idea if we move these guys close to our base so we can trade with them a little bit easier because this is going to be a pain running back and forth. So I think the next trip we will come back and we'll set up a some place of building our structure where we can put them and then we'll boat them across. It'll take a little bit of time, but we can get them there. That'll work. Okay, so. Almost there. Hopefully this will get some new trades if we trade enough with these two items because otherwise we don't have enough trades. Okay, so our holes right here. I hear them. That's good. Make sure nothing can get us. There we go. Here's this guy. He says, oh, you're back, thankfully. Okay, so I'm going to give you that, and I'll get an emerald. What a deal. Yeah. This guy didn't do anything. Okay, so now we have two emeralds. So we need a lot more emeralds for sure. So that's something we got to figure out. So let's go back home, and let's create a place where we can dump these guys off. Um... Good old dirt building, right? So we have some space right over here. This might be a good place to do it. So let's just fill this in. Right around the corner, we're going to make our little villager station. And uh, we can probably make it so that we can um, have like a place where they stand. And we can just like, so they won't be moving around. But for now, let's build up a building here. I figure we're going to eventually try to get one guy here and one guy here. So let's do this like that. And uh, this is, looks very ugly. I don't care about how it looks, honestly. I just want it to function. So we have to get them into this area. And I'm going to fill that in that hole. So we're going to try to get the boat in here. And that's something else that I'm worried about is this boat and how it's going to work. I wish I had a torch in here or something. Because we've got to get over this terrain. I really need to have a path that's at the right height to get here. So let's let's do that. We're going to make a path that's going to go right over here and into here. Okay. So if we call it this level here is what we have to get to. Let's build a path out. This is going to be a little bit of awkwardness and kind of like build the structure junk. Let's also put a torch. I want to have a little torch path to kind of know what I intended here. So we can go around this corner. Try to get as smooth of a place we don't have to go up. The problem is not going down, but it's going up is the biggest problem with this process. So. We're going to go around here. Okay, we don't mind coming down here, but we would rather go through. So let's make our little uh, canal here. I know it's probably kind of boring for people. I understand that. Um, we could go up here is okay we got to make sure that we i gotta eat too oh my gosh okay i don't want to go too high but because if we go too high we got to do oh we could probably do this too we just got to make sure we get them up to a level that we can work with
Okay. So this kind of works out if we follow this torch path and we stay at this level. We don't have to go up. So that's the thing. I don't want to have to piston or make some sort of piston contraption to get people to go upwards. So that's a pain. We have to build it and execute all that. Okay, so if we do this path, we should be able to get to there pretty easily. Okay. And I don't want to do the boating during the night. So let's uh, let's go back. Let's make a couple of boats and get set for the next day, okay? So. Boat. A couple of boats. No more emeralds. We don't have any more emeralds or rotten flesh, so we're stuck with that. And we're going to be having them put into this spot in here. It's not very big, I know. So let's um, let's widen this outfield. So I have a place where they can get them out and they won't, you know, run away. Some way we can lock them in before we get them into their stations, you know. A little villager management. It's not fun, but it'll work. Okay. Torch back here. And I think we need to have some sort of door or something to get into this room. Something that they can't open up, but we can. I'm just doing this on the fly, guys. I did not prep for this video at all. I just said, let's just, let's do this. So let me make a doors. Let's make some buttons. Really? Buttons. We'll sleep and then we're going to start the move. See if we can get the villagers here. Um, I'm going to put a button on each side. Okay, it's getting dark. Let's sleep. Let's go get these villagers over here. Hmm. Coffee. <clears throat> Okay, so let's go and get them. We gotta get these boats ready. We're gonna do one at a time. Hopefully get them in the boats first and then we have to run, follow the path. We, as long as we don't go stepping down, we'll be okay. So we're going along here. See, I made this little path, that'll be awesome. I'm gonna go around this way. We'll go around here. You notice how we're not going up at all with the boat. That's the trick with this. Okay, this might be a little bit more of a boring episode now that I think about it because, like, you know, we're not really doing any actual machine work. But I think this is going to be critical for some of the stuff we need to do later on. We definitely have to get ender pearls. And I, the only ways I can, th I can think of three ways right now that we can get ender pearls. And that is that we have to do this, which is getting it for, through trading with a villager. We have to make some sort of mob farm here in the overworld where we use um, some of those vector plates and other things to kill them, but they keep teleporting away. We tested that out in the live stream. And then the other way, and this is the one that we got to kind of figure out, is go maybe go to uh, the end and, and do some stuff there. Okay, so okay, let's do this. Let's hide this out so we can't uh, they can't do anything here. Let's set a boat down. And I think we can get rid of these. Okay. We got two of these guys. Come on. Oh, the glass is in the way. Okay. Uh, might as well get your bed, too. Okay, come on, get in the boat. No, no. What the heck? Wow. Almost died there. Oh, God. That's not how that's supposed to work. But they're in the boat. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's get this boat here. And let's see if we can get them through the wall. Where are we trying to go to? It's right this level right here. That's a good exit. So we got to get these guys into different boats. So, so let me see if I can get this out here. Let's try. Uh. Okay, that one right there, and you right there. Okay, that's great. Excellent. Okay, we're gonna take you first. And we're going to get you out of here. And we're going to fill this in so we can't lose the dude. There we go. 
All right. <clears throat> we are sailing along. Hmm. Maybe we should uh, do a little speed up of the video here for you. Here we go. just like that guys we now have two villagers here and we do that in a single day a game day so that's good it's getting dark and you know what i do when it's dark i sleep i also will eat a little bit and i'll have some coffee can't sleep yet but i'll still start drinking my coffee because you know it's really good mm-hmm mm -hmm. oh that tastes good okay so i've been thinking about this while we were doing this and for you it was a short time but for me it took me <laughs> an entire game day that I want to have a way of getting these guys separated. And I think I'm going to put them down in a hole inside of here. So we're going to do that right now. I'm going to come in here and let's make a hole for each of these guys. Um, let's put one, I don't know, right over there. Let's see. Let me get this guy out. Oops. Sorry, buddy. And I'm going to make a hole here so they can't get out. And we're going to try to get him into the hole. Really? Uh, I don't like that. Oh, one got, no, 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 don't go in there. Okay, uh, block. He almost did too, he was ready to go. Why are you a farmer? Why aren't you a, 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 uh, you're a cleric? Let's put one over here, a hole. And I would like you to go into that hole, please. I don't want you to go out here. As you just did come out here, go back back into your hole no well if you want to be right there i'll put you right there here you go okay now you're in your hole too ah okay that works out really well so now we have them set up and i can work on making like a little station there where we can talk with them uh down lower so if we think about it they're gonna be there's a block here and a block that i want to like here's a brew stand same thing over here Okay, so that's where they can talk to us. And if I do this, they should not be able to get out here at all because the brew stand is in the way. Right? Okay, so that's good. Now, why are you a farmer when I know there's farms here stuff, but I don't want you to be like a farmer. I want you to rebind to the bounce of the farm. Oh, wait, no, wait, oh, he changed over to a cleric. Awesome. Okay, so there we go. We have like a little villager area here. That's awesome. Now this guy takes, again, rotten flesh and emeralds. And this guy here takes rotten flesh and emeralds. So we're going to have to go and find some rotten flesh and emeralds. And or that. And they've got to beauty this up. This is pretty bad. Uh, I'm not sure what I want to do with this yet. I don't want things to get here either. So I'm going to block this off now. Hopefully nothing can get in there but a baby zombie, right? Uh, but at least we can still talk with them. That's good. Okay, so we have to figure out a way, guys, to get emeralds or rotten flesh. Uh, we really need to have, like, a killing area that we can get items for 
to get rotten flesh or some emeralds. And emeralds, again, that really the only way you can get emeralds, it looks like, is through emerald. Well, we can get it through rotten flesh if we trade for it, right? So we can either have some sort of zombie flesh farm, which is not exactly ideal for us, because that's a lot that we have to get just to get it, or we have to go and find some emeralds. So I'm going to have to think on this, guys. I'm not sure uh, what we're going to do. But uh, we'll have to figure it out. I'm going to take a screenshot of this. This will probably be for my thumbnail. So, oh. And, guys, I think that's all we're going to do for today. I'm not sure how long this video is, but with the uh, movement, it's, it'll probably be close to 20 minutes. So, the next episode, we're going to try to get some emeralds or some rotten flesh. We're going to try to get these ender pearls. See if we can get these villagers working for us instead of against us. And hopefully, after that, we'll have all the necessary things to make these solar panels pretty quickly. Okay? Anyway, guys, if you like this video, please click that like button. If you have any comments, put them down in the comment section. And if you'd like to be notified of the videos I produce, please subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you get all the notifications, okay? Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.